Hey guys, what's up? I'm the Silvered Grunion, and it's Friday, July 12th, 2019. And we're playing a little bit of Fire Pro Wrestling World here on PlayStation 4 as we prepare for a fun and exciting weekend full of excitement, action, and probably work. What can I say? But I've been out of commission for about a week now, and it was good yesterday to finally stream, and I decided I didn't want to go another couple days without streaming, so I figured here's the perfect chance to play some fun fire pro wrestling action and talk to all of you, my legions of fans. I say that sarcastically. It's really just my grandmother and her three friends who don't know nothing about video games, but damn it all, they watch me play. By the way, this is the uh, All Elite Wrestling uh, set up here as we got Chris Jericho taking on Kenny Omega. A match that headlined their very first pay-per-view just about a month ago. I like the graphics of this game. They're very simplistic. They, this series has been around since about 1989, but uh, the graphics have improved a little bit over the years, but not too much. They've never strayed too far away from their roots. The 2D sprites, the clean and fluid animation has served them very well, but I think the real meat and potatoes of the Fire Pro series is the excellent AI, the artificial intelligence. Through a series of very, very intricate modifications that you can make within the game, uh, you can basically make every wrestler do everything that you want them to do the exact way you want them to. You want Chris Jericho to be a dirty heel? It can be done. Do you want Hulk Hogan to be a rousing babyface who plays to the crowd? It can be done. And do you want Silvered Grunion to take over the wrestling world? by winning every championship ever made. Well, even Fire Pro can't do that, but you can pretty much do everything else. This is my go-to game when I don't know what I want to play. If I'm not quite sure, if I have one of those days where I'm just like, you know what? I'm not quite positive what I'm in the mood for. You can always put in Fire Pro for five or 10 minutes and just like that, the creative juices start flowing. Generally speaking, I, I end up playing Fire Pro for about an hour or two or five, depending on if I have to work. And hopefully here you can see why this back and forth action here between Chris Jericho and Kenny Omega is probably some of the best in-game wrestling action that you're going to see uh, in 2019. And that's not a knock on other, other, other games, games like WWE 2K, a series that falls under fire quite often, but to be honest, it's one of my favorite games of all time. But I do think that Fire Pro Wrestling World, look at this, ooh, beautiful maneuver there by Kenny Omega. Uh, I do think Fire Pro Wrestling World uh, really captures the essence of professional wrestling in a way that nobody else has or possibly will. It was not too long ago, actually, that uh, Kenny Omega, the, the man in green tights that you're watching here, uh, actually tweeted out that he was hoping to bring back the engine from an old game called WWF No Mercy. It was the AK... AK I can never say it right. The AKI engine. And it's been revered as possibly one of the greatest wrestling game engines of all time. And has not been seen since the year 2000. So 20 years later, Kenny Omega is hoping that All Elite Wrestling can uh, revitalize that franchise. I'm not sure of the legalities and the linguistics that will go into that, but if he can pull it off, if All Elite Wrestling can... Uh, somehow secure that coup, then no doubt they will be possibly giving Fire Pro Wrestling a run for its money in terms of realism and fan base worldwide. Yeah. 
and this match is certainly swinging into the favor of one Chris Jericho, who is now totally in control of the cleaner Kenny Omega. These two have had two matches in real life, and they are one-to-one. -one. Kenny Omega won their first matchup in New Japan Pro Wrestling, and Chris Jericho picked up the rematch victory just a month ago at All Elite Wrestling's first ever major pay-per-view. And now Jericho is setting him up on the corner. Oh, but Omega counters and brings him down with a tombstone pile driver off the top rope. There's the cover. And ladies and gentlemen, it's over. Your winner, the cleaner, Kenny Omega. All right, guys. Well, that's going to do it for me for right now. But this was fun. Uh, I hope whatever you're doing, have a fun and safe Friday. I am the Silvered Grunion, and I'll see you soon.